be studying personal training and it's quite like what I expected it to be because I did fitness instructing last year and it's like an advanced version of that. It's a lot more in depth with the anatomy and physiology. A lot of the gym stuff you learn a lot more new things whereas before it was very basic. We do three mornings of theory and then we do two afternoons of practical and we have an hour session in the morning as well. So we do two afternoons at Oasis Gym of practical and a one hour session at the sports hall. Yeah, it's really helped me progress because with the fitness instructing course you got lots of different qualifications throughout the year um, and with that I've been able to go and get um, insurance to become a freelance instructor so I teach things like spinning and circuit classes um, at gyms um, and then hopefully this year I'll be able to further that and go on and do personal training. Hopefully next year I'll be going on to the sports science uh, degree. I initially wanted to do an art course, I wanted to be a tattooist. I came to the college looking for a new avenue because that wasn't working out for me. I got to the college and found out that the course really wasn't for me. I met with James Winning who persuaded me to go into the outdoor adventure course which I thoroughly enjoyed. I ended up getting really high grades on that and wanted to become a teacher which is sort of following in his footsteps so I saw him as a role model. Once I finished the course with a distinction profile I got onto the HE uh, Sport Foundation Award level 4 or 5, completed that and then I went on to the um, top up degree which is the Bachelor's in Sport Studies. Alongside all of that, I've been doing Mountain Leader training to get the Mountain Leader Awards sort of in the same area of what James William was doing so that I can teach outdoor adventure wherever I like to alongside Mountain Leader. I've also had opportunities to do teaching assistant and coaching assistant within the college which is support my studies as well as my ambitions and what I want to do because essentially I want to become a FD tutor in a college. I'm studying the BH Honours in Sports Studies uh, course. It's everything I expected. It's, it's very challenging, a lot harder than the level 4 and 5. It's making me search new avenues to sort of make my learning progress more effectively. You don't get as much support as level 5, which is good because you're trying to make it more university style. Um, but all in all, I'm really enjoying it. It's everything I expected it to be. Practical work to a degree because of the, you've got to do volunteer work, which I'm doing teaching alongside the college, and it involves a lot of theoretical sort of abstract brainstorming, which is really fun because you get to sort of think about what interests you and then you get to write about that, which you don't get in a lot of universities. It's, it's sort of a niche thing that I really enjoy in the college. Through the progression that I've done from level four to level six, it's really reiterated and reaffirmed my thought of being a teacher because I managed to go into different modules with maths and leader and teaching on the side of my head. So everything I've done has been orientated towards that and all of the teachers have really helped me with that. So even if there's a module that's not specifically about teaching or outdoor ed, they've let me orientate it around that and I've still managed to get the good grades and still managed to withdraw the learn that and criteria.